And we've got also now lined up for a one of these. Uh, I've never seen. I don't know if you've seen one when you no. spent your time in Australia. But we've got the pajama up there now, <laughs> the pajama squid. Can you tell us a little? Because this some um, again, we've I've never seen. How big are they compared to, uh, say, a flamboyant cuttlefish? Oh geez, I mean they're. I mean those those ones were maybe like that. Okay. Um, that you know, a few that. inches. Um, yeah, you know, when we went to Australia. You know, cold water diving isn't isn't our necessarily <laughs> favorite thing that we that we do, but it was a goal of mine to to go to Australia because they have so many so many unique uh, creatures mm. down there. Um, and and on the list, number one was the the cuttlefish mating uh, and aggregation, um, and then obviously the leafy and weedy uh, sea dragons, and then the the other one was the the bobtail uh, squid there. So, or not the bobtail, the the pajama squid. Yeah. So um so yeah i mean it was like i said i i told my guides like hey i want to i want to do this you got to take me you got to show me you know where these things are at and uh it was funny we dropped in off of the edithburg jetty and uh i just dropped in you know there's maybe 10 feet of water and you know i'm kind of waiting for my guide and i've got my lights on and i i, I put my head down and Oh, there's, there's a couple right there, you know? So, I mean, they were just kind of everywhere um, oh, yeah. and it was, it was great. So uh, this particular one, the mating, I, I hadn't really seen any footage of that. Um, and it's, it was a special event. And quite frankly, I was pretty lucky to have, to have gotten it. Yeah. Uh, okay, well. You know, especially for it to capture it when it started. Right. Um, I mean, I was just lining up for a shot of that particular, uh, you know, uh, squid there and the other one kind of latched on to it and i happened to be rolling so uh it it worked out perfectly amazing yeah and i noticed one thing during this uh this clip that you you, uh, you had great luck with the, the cuttlefish coming in uh to actually mate and at that stage your heartbeat must have been going like wow it's happening right now you know like <laughs> You know, and and then because they made a mess, some things start to to flow through it. But you hold it there, and then eventually yeah. they turn to the camera like, uh, <laughs> by by you staying still. How could you do that? <laughs> like, and not like, okay, I need to get the best angle like this, and eventually then throw away this this fantastic uh, event. You know. No, I. I, I remember setting up and it, it went on like, is this happening? I, I took my eyes off the monitor and I'm going, and then I started looking around going, is anybody else seeing this? Right, right. <laughs> uh, sure. you know, my, wife was, my wife was in the water, the guide was in the water, and then uh, Dean Sprackman was, was in the water and um, nobody saw it but me. Wow. And, uh, you know, they, they did their thing and I, I finally picked up my my camera and I went to go to go grab Dean and they they broke apart after that so and then I sh I showed it to him because Dean's a local down there and he uh, I showed him it on the on the monitor and he was just like <laughs> you know we've never seen anything like that so uh, I was pretty excited about that footage so yeah yeah top quality what uh, which part of Australia are we talking about here is this uh, Victoria. Uh, no, that was in uh, Edithburg uh, in South Australia. Okay, so quite cold. Oh yeah, yeah. Water was fifty-two okay. degrees. Yeah, dry suit. Dry suit. Dry suit. Yeah, you're. I was gonna say. I know you know Peter Lightaller. Yeah, uh, he was with us. Okay, uh, but he wasn't. He wasn't diving on that dive. Oops. So <laughs> that was unfortunate too. So Ouch. was this daytime or nighttime with the mating? This, the mating was actually, um, it was late afternoon okay. is, is when it was, so. Mm -hmm.